Lionel. I'm a physicist, and this is how to estimate transition probability. When we speak of transition probability, we're actually thinking about a quantum mechanical system. So if we have something in state 1, we can estimate the probability that it will transition to state 2. Now, the equation, transition probability, from 1 to 2, can actually be written as some matrix element, 1, V, 2, multiplied by the density of states, and that is multiplied by 2 pi over h bar. So you're probably wondering what these are. So the first thing is just a matrix element, and it's a measure of how much state 1 is coupled with state 2. And what this means is how much they influence each other. The closer two quantum particles are allowed to approach one another, the more influence they have on each other. So this is really just a measure of that. The next one is the density of states. And this is simply the number of states per unit energy level. And the last one is simply 2 pi over h bar. h bar is Planck's constant. So calculating each one of these separately, we can find the transition probability going from state 1 to state 2. I'm Ryan Alton. This is How to Estimate Transition Probability.